everybody, my name is Maggie Sanazero, and at Berea this year I'll be teaching piano lessons, voice lessons, and worship team ensemble. In this particular video, I want to talk about voice lessons, and one of the main questions I get about voice lessons is, if my student already has a really good voice, do they really need to take voice lessons? And the answer is yes, that's actually who is perfect for voice lessons. Um, your body can be naturally inclined to do a lot of different things, right? You have kids who may be really fast or who um, are really artistically gifted or they have great flexibility and you wanna get them into gymnastics or art class or track and field or whatever to help them grow that natural talent into some really great and developed skill. And voice is the same way. You may have a really naturally beautiful instrument but I can help you through voice lessons find exercises and correct breathing and um, a lot of other techniques and skills to take that raw talent to the next level of being a really great musician. Um, so voice lessons include a lot of music theory as well as just how to use your voice as a well-trained instrument. Um, there are lots of different genres of music out there and so there's a lot of different techniques and different things you use. Um, when you sing for worship on Sunday would be very different than you would in a musical theater production or singing rock or country or jazz. They all have very different elements um, to those different musical styles that you would kind of change your voice for. But regardless of the style you like or what your goals are, all singers work to have good vocal health, work to have good knowledge of music theory as they're singing, and strong breathing, right? Breathing from the diaphragm so you have a nice, strong, supported sound for your voice. Um, we also place the sound well so there's resonance and it doesn't sound flat or kind of um, just sometimes tinty or some sounds kind of get funny if we put them in our nose. So when we do voice lessons, we start each week by doing warm-ups and exercises that really strengthen the voice and again, working on that breathing so that no matter what genre we're singing, our voice sounds strong and supported. And then, just like anything else I teach, I get to know you as a student and know what do you like? What songs do you like? What style of music? What particular performers do you really enjoy listening to? And then we talk about your musical goals and go, okay, how can we get your voice to sound the way you would like it to sound or, or to use it the way you would like to? And so we use all that skill and technique and then we apply it to whatever uh, genre or type of music you're interested in doing. So you don't really need much of anything other than yourself for a voice lesson. If you want to bring a recorder of some kind, like an iPad or an iPhone or something, um, just to record our lesson so you can practice at home, that's great, but you don't have to have it. You just need to come with your voice ready to sing and ready to practice at home. So if you're interested in voice lessons, please follow the information on the Burrito website and I look forward to meeting you in person.